Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and I'm so excited to film another putting photo cards away into my binders video. So I have quite a lot. I actually also just received a new binder, so now I have four binders. So I rearranged everything. So let's start with getting my box with all of my photo cards. I wanted to wait actually because there's a lot still coming in, but I mean there's always something coming in, so I thought let's just start because I have so much. Because of all the comebacks, the new BTS albums, new NCT album, Mr. X album, so yeah. Let me get everything out and sort them by group. So as you guys know, my three ults are BTS, NCT and Monster X, so a lot of it is those three groups. It's pretty much always the same groups, to be honest, because I don't collect a lot of groups because it's just too much. But we do have some stray kits. So I am in the middle of trading a lot, so some of them haven't come in yet because I didn't pull any Tay at all in my BTS albums and I didn't pull Taeyang in my uh, NCT albums, so that's fun. So we do have some Baekhyun. So let's first start with BTS. So I did, I mean you can actually still see it, which I kind of sucks, but I didn't like the photos in the front. So I put them now here so I can see it when it's on my shelves. I can see which groups are in here. So right now in this binder are BTS, Girls' Generation and EXO because NCT needed their own binder. So let's first start with the normal size photo cards, which I have three of them. This one is already traded and these two I still need to trade. So if someone has V version, I think two and four, please let me know because I haven't found any trades yet. Version one I already traded, but hasn't come in, but I do have version three V. So let's show you guys. I already put some of them in sleeves to protect them uh, while I was storing them in the box. But let's put it in. I put it in the binder. So I have a new, I changed a lot actually, but I have a new system where I put these things when I already, when they're on the way. So I have one on the way, but this is version three. I rearranged also my Monster X photo cards, but you will see when we get to that, so. Oh my god, I'm so excited. As I said, I wanted to wait, but I just can't wait when I have so many photo cards to store away. So let's put these two here because I am still trying to trade them. So this is my trading page for people who are wondering. These are all the photo cards I still haven't been able to trade yet. I wish I could collect OT7. I mean, pretty much for all of my ults, I want to collect everyone, but especially BTS is just too expensive so i finally traded my here we go i did just rearrange it but i kind of want to put these behind it because these are newer and these ones are before that so i did have a space here i used to have namjoon but i finally managed to trade with the same person i traded my my math so seven photo card for it just came in today but i finally got these the most beautiful moment in life part one Big photo card. So let's put that here. So it's all coming together. I'm still not missing a lot, but some of them I still don't have the albums. So I'm still waiting to get those. But it's a slow, collecting is a slow progress. So that's okay. So now we have <laughs> all of the same postcards and the booklets from the seven album. So let's put the postcards here. So here we got two sleeves. So like I said in my Unboxing, I did wish they would have had different postcards for the different versions because last time we got member postcards, but this time we got obviously all the same, which I love them, but I mean, I wish they would be different. And obviously I don't really want to put all of them in here, but I mean, since, since they fit in the four pockets, I mean, it would look nicer to put all of them in. So that's what I'm going to do. So it's kind of strange that the whole world is in quarantine, quarantine right now. With all of the things happening in the world, it's nice to just focus on nice things like K-pop. Just to get your mind off of things because obviously I can't work right now. Because I am working in a restaurant and all of them are closed right now. So, so let's now put in the booklets. So we got all the booklets here. I did take out some of the things like the standees and such. But let's put them here. Like I said, if you saw my unboxing, I love the album so, so much. Someone was really <laughs> not nice in the comments saying, why would you spend money on such a horrible album? And I was like, well, 
You don't have to. That's your opinion, but I love the album so much. I mean, I love the songs. Not everything about the packaging was amazing, but we still love it so much. Oh my god, love it. So, yeah, that was it for BTS. So let's now go on to EXO, because I don't have any Taeyeon at the moment. So for Baekhyun, I finally got some photo cards and this slide thingy. So, first we got finally I traded for, let me get it out. Baekhyun Super M US version. Oh my god, I don't know why, but it took so long to get it. I'm so happy I finally got it. And then I also claimed this one from a go. I really want to claim the other, uh, the EXO version, but the person who did the go already claimed it herself, so I got these two. So let's put them in sleeves and put them in the bina. I've realized that collecting Baekhyun is kind of harder than, for example, NCT or Monster X, because especially the older photo cards, I haven't even started collecting the older albums and photo cards, but I feel like it's going to be so hard because the same as Ghost Generation, all the photo cards are just harder to get. So I've noticed some of the other YouTubes, YouTubers I watch who collect EXO, they can be quite hard to find. So then we got, let's see, this is the EXO version. And I also traded for the Obsession version the other day. So that's exciting. So let's get this off because the other side I still need to put in. And then I also got, finally, let me show you guys, the XXO version slide, photo slide thingy. So this one actually came in way before the EXO version, but it got damaged in the mail. And I told the person who traded with me, it wasn't her fault, but she insisted she would buy another one and send it to me for free. And I was like, no, you don't have to do that. But she really is insisted. So she resent it to me for free and I was like, oh my god, you're too nice. So yeah, that was it for this binder. So let's now go on to my NCT binder, which used to be SM, but is now only NCT. So here we've got NCT binder. I put Taeyang on, in, on spine. So let's go. This is actually a brand new binder. I just got it in the mail. So for Taeyang, I got... Oh my god, I got so many special photo cards, so... I didn't pull any of the Neo Zone photo cards for Taeyong because why would I pull my bias? So I'm in the middle of training, so I did trade already for one of them, but it hasn't arrived yet. So here we got the special photo cards. Oh my god, you can't even believe, you can't even understand how excited I am. I finally got Taeyong's paper toy photo card. Oh my god, usually people, especially Taeyong's, over overprice them so much. I've seen them for like more than $50. Like, insane i actually saw someone selling it on ebay for a hundred dollars but that in did include the paper toy but still i mean so yeah i did rearrange a lot of things here more precisely i did take out some of the placeholders because i just didn't think i was ever going to get those special cards because i do want to collect a lot of Taeyong special cards but some of them are just really hard to get so i did get the Neo Zone, Standy, and photo card set, which just got in the mail yesterday. Okay, so this was so hard to get off. Oh my god. But yeah, SM always does so many things for a comeback to get our money. And I always buy them. <laughs> but yeah, that's why NCT needs their own binder. Oh my god. So I've, I got Taeyong's Neo Zone holographic photo card. I am planning on getting all of the holographic standee sets. I mean, I do did get a lot of them, so I am planning to collect all of them eventually because I feel like they're gonna release them every comeback now, so. So yeah, I love these so much, oh my God. So I did put the placeholder here, so let's put it in. Oh my God, it looks so nice. So then I got Finally got the US version of the Super M tour photo cards. So I didn't realize, but these ones are actually so different from the European version. Let me show you guys. Because I was lucky enough to actually pull Taeyang in both the Europe and American version. But look at the difference. Both of them are official because I this one I ordered on the official Super M shop. And this one I ordered at the venue of the concert. So this one is actually shiny and this one is matte. 
This one is also a different kind of size, I don't know. And it's cut differently, so this one is more zoomed out than this one. So yeah, I didn't want it to trade, but now I want to keep both of them. So yeah, let's put them in. So I did already reorganize this page. So let's get my Taeyong for the cards. So this is actually exactly the same. It's kind of more zoomed in than this one, and it's also matte. So yeah, let me show you guys all the new photo cards I got. So here we got my poofs. So let's put them in. So let's all put them all in sleeves and put them on a page and fill up the left page. So I finally have a full page. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed with Neo Sound. Like, it's all I've been listening to for this last two weeks. Wait, has it already, already been out for two weeks? Maybe just one week. But I have been obsessed with Kick It. Like, obsessed. Definitely my all-time favorite title track. So let's see. Hmm. So I think what I'm gonna do is, you know what? I really wanna put all of the two of the cards on the same page. So let's take this one out because this is the 2019 tour photo card. And let's put the brand new photo card, the holographic one, in here. So now I can put all of the tour photo cards on this page. Right, let me screw it over him and put all of them here. So we got the first one, the second one. So I sorted them, so let's put them all in. These first three months of the year have, so, have, have been so fun, music-wise, because literally all three of my old groups have come back. I have a new Monster X album, a new BTS album, and a new NCT album. So that's all I've been listening to these last few weeks. I've made a playlist of all three of the new albums, so I love it so much. And oh my god, I'm so happy Wono has been cleared from all of his charges. I mean, when I say that was one of the most, one of the happiest day of the year, I'm not exaggerating, wait, what? Okay, so this doesn't really look nice. So let's switch this one. Okay, wait, let me reorganize everything. Oh my god, why am I so stupid? You know what, I might switch these around. Oh my god, this is probably gonna get cut down so much, but now I finally have the right order, so I have the two US 2019 versions, the two US 2020 version, the US random photo card, and the European photo card, and the European random photo card. You might see these two and these two are so similar why keep both but i don't know since i put them i just kind of want to keep all of them so let's now go on to tens page because i obviously have tens us version for the cards where's 10 yes 10. so let's also put these in i didn't pull his random photo card so i'm still trying to trade guys European version for 10th European version. Obviously, I'm not gonna collect the US and European versions for this one because it's just because I put them, I'm like, keeping them, but I really don't need two, two of them. So let's put them in. So let's do the same way as Taeyang. So let's put the red one, the duplicate here. And let's put the other one in the middle. I actually prefer the European one because they feel so much more high quality and they actually remind me so much of... I don't know, they remind me so much of normal Korean photo cards instead of these like paper thingies. So let's go on to my... I also traded one of the circle cards, uh, my Mark one for Taeyang and I separated the normal photo cards and the circle cards because I saw some people saying they leave imprints on photo cards so I really want to separate them so now I have my circle card page so here I have no new photo cards but I obviously do have I rearranged everything when I found out that the US photo cards were different so let's see what I had in mind, because obviously I kind of forgot. Bekyon is on a different page, let's get him out. I think I wanted to put this one here. This one here. Hmm. Well, it's not gonna look 
good regardless so let's just do it this way i wanted to keep the middle i don't think this is gonna look good i don't know how i feel about this okay so let me rearrange everything it's going to take a long time so let me so i'll be back when i rearranged everything so i finally thought of the layout so i sleeved off them so let's now put them all in and show you guys when i've put them in what it looks like so let's put them all in so yeah i still can get over the fact that i did see a super m in concert in paris just three weeks ago and then literally when i got back home like five days later they announced that all concerts in france were cancelled and now obviously concerts like events with more than 100 people are also cancelled in my country but yeah i got so lucky because obviously the concert would have been cancelled if it was just one or two weeks later so i'm so happy i at least got to see a super emmy concert before everything went down because now the sale for bts is postponed and stray kids tour which i wanted to go to in europe has been cancelled so i don't know it sucks so much and obviously there's a legit reason for it because the whole world is a mess right now look at it it looks so good i mean us europe us europe i think this looks good yeah i think it does so let's do the same thing for mark guess lucas mark <laughs> i don't know but yeah i'm really sad stray kids got cancelled at least BTS concert is the sale is postponed because the sale was supposed to be tomorrow but now the sale has been delayed till May I believe so I hope they will come to Rotterdam but I'm not sure I don't know how long this is going to take because it feels like it keeps getting worse and worse but in China it's contained so I hope the same, same thing will happen in Europe soon oh my god this looks so good Oh my god, I love it so much. I love getting full sets because I just normally don't. So I did pull this Hyuk and this Johnny, but obviously I am going to trade them for Taeyang because he is my bias and I am collecting him. But let's for now just put him on my training. Well, actually, let's put the circle card with the other ones in the place where Taeyang is supposed to be. Like I said, I really want to put circle cards on a separate page to protect the rest. So yeah, I do want to trade it. So if anyone has it, please let me know. So then I have more NCT stuff. This is the reason why this binder is so full. Uh, obviously, I still have the standee, which I am going to put on the back of the Super M standees. So let's put it here. Because I am planning on getting also the superhuman standy set, maybe, and go back to that. So let's also put the sticker sheets in here. So obviously the sticker sheets are not going to fit in these normal two pocket sleeves, I guess. Yeah, but I think they're going to fit in these special ones. Yeah, so let's get those. So these are just one pocket sleeves. <laughs> But yeah, that will do for now. I have seen some bigger two pocket sleeves floating around on the internet in the K-pop community. So I might look for that. Let's see. The, yeah, this is the end version. So let's put that here on top. So I did just yesterday pre-order to put it a little higher because it's quite big. So I did pre-order the C version yesterday. So I'm really excited to get that in the mail. And I also or that Wavy's album thingy. That's exciting. So I think this actually looks quite good. I might take it out later, but I love it so much. I think I should have put it behind because this one is newer. I literally just rearranged everything when the binder came in like a few hours ago. So now I'm again rearranging everything. So I think that's it for this binder. Yeah, that's it for NCT, but I did forget to put Baekhyun's Super M photo card in the other binder. So let's go back to the first binder and go to Baekhyun, because I obviously already did Baekhyun. But I forgot about his Super M photo cards, which are supposed to be here. This one is actually so pretty. Like, wow, I love it so much. Like I said, I do prefer 
the style photo card from the European version. But I think I do prefer this picture because it's literally one of my fave pictures ever by Bekian. Let's put the red one on top. So I'm not going to try and get this random photo card because I only have one photo card to trade. So I prefer to get 10. But yeah, oh my God, this looks so good. So let's now go, go on to my third binder. So here we got my third binder, which is mainly Hono and Monster X, but also Stray Kids, but I do have a lot of Monster X photo cards. So let's see, I have a Wono, 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 and then the new album photo cards. Okay, so let's first go on to this one. So like I said earlier, I don't know when, but I talked about Wono finally being cleared of all his charges, which I could have said three months ago, but oh well. <laughs> so here we got my photo cards, especially this one. I've been looking for it so, so much. Oh my God, I'm so excited to finally have it. So let's see. So I have his the code decode version photo card. I can't even remember we, what I traded this for, but I think it was probably one of my show new photo cards, I guess. So let's put that here. I'm really trying to focus on finishing my Wono collection because I just love this collection so, so much. Yay. So I did separate separate the solo photo cards and the unit photo cards, which used to be combined, but I did like it more when they are separated because it just gives you more of an overview of everything. So I can't believe I finally got this one. Actually, someone messaged me, which was so nice. And I really liked trading with her. So I trusted her and she messaged me like I pulled one out again because I was too late the first time. And it was so nice for her to message me. Oh my God, yay. So then we go onto the unit pages. And like, as you saw, I got my key on one out unit, which are my two biases in the group, which I'm so excited for. Again, can't remember what I traded, but Let's put it here. Actually, earlier this week, I, I really wanted to buy all the unit photo cards, but it's kind of expensive. So I'm kind of waiting to get the albums first once again. But I mean, I already got both the code albums. So yay. So let's now go on to Keon's page because I did manage to trade my uh, I am photo card, which I pulled from the All About Love album for Kian, which I am collecting for this album. So I hope Wono comes back. But if he decides to not come back, I will start. I will continue collecting Kian from now on. So then let's put the group photo card on this page. I actually bought a lot of Tutakum photo card sets recently, so they should be coming in soon, which is exciting because they're really cheap actually. And then, hmm, I don't know where to put this Juan photo card. Maybe I'll, I think I'm gonna keep it. So let's put it here for now on this page, which I am keeping because it fills out the space nice, nicely, even though there's a lot of Tukum photo cards coming. But yeah, I think that's it for Monster X. And then now I only have a few Strickets photo cards left. So I finally managed to trade for this Hyunjin photo card which I'm so excited about. And then I bought, I finally saw someone selling this mixtape for the card, which I've been looking for so much. And then she also sold a lot of other Hyunjin photo cards for not really expensive because Hyunjin is really expensive. So then I thought, you know what? Let's just buy all three of these for my. So now I have three new photo cards from Hyunjin, which honestly, at first I didn't want to collect all of his photo cards, but ever since I really wanted to collect them, but I'm not collecting all versions of the albums. I really into collecting him and I love his photo cards so much. Honestly, I love Stray Kids photo cards. I think my favorites are still the uh, I Am You photo cards because they're really beautiful with the pastel pinky borders and such. But I do also really love the Yellowwood photo cards. So let's put them in. So, oh my God, I can't believe I finally got his mixtape photo card because I did trade the first one. Oh, wait, I think I traded my mixtape photo card for another photo card. It, it isn't even important, but I did trade 
my Chen mixtape photo card for this one and then I decided to buy that one and buy the other ones, yeah. That was my train of thought. <laughs> so let's put this back. <clears throat> oh, I waited, it, oops. So let's put a new one in here. So the IMQ photo card on the back. I love how organized I am because normally in real life I'm not really organized. So these ones are my fave, honestly. So then I got the Yellowwood photo cards. So this is my favorite Yellowwood photo card with the yellow border. So let's put that right here. And put this, wait. Yeah, I don't have the making photo card yet. That's the only Leventa photo card I still have to get. Oh, and also obviously they, they made a Japanese de debut. Whoa, I can't speak. They made their Japanese debut, but I'm not gonna get Japanese photo cards or Japanese albums from Stray Kids. So I just don't really collect Japanese photo cards at all, except for some of my old Japanese albums. So I'm also not gonna collect the Japanese photo cards. For Stray Kids, oh my God, it's finally coming together. So I did actually just trade for this. So let's put a little thingy there. Actually, I just used this really thin washi tape. So let's put that here. So let's now, oh wait, it's right here. So let's put the purple border, which is one of my faves. This one is still my favorite, but I mean, this is my second favorite Leventa photo card. It's actually coming together quite nicely. Oh my God. Yay, and that was it already. Oh my god. So yeah, that was it. I hope you liked it. If you liked it, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!